We start by multiplying and dividing the denominator of the integrand with root 2. Therefore, the given integral is equal to 1 upon root 2 times integral dx upon 1 upon root 2 cos x minus 1 upon root 2 sin x. This can be written as 1 upon root 2 times integral dx upon sine of pi upon 4 cos x minus cos of pi upon 4 sin x. And this is equal to 1 upon root 2 integral dx upon sine of pi upon 4 minus x. Therefore, the given integral is equal to 1 upon root 2 integral cosec pi upon 4 minus x dx. Now, cosec pi upon 4 minus x can be written as cosec of pi minus pi upon 4 minus x. And this is because of the property that sine of pi minus x is equal to sine of x. And therefore, 1 upon sine of pi minus x or cosec pi minus x is equal to 1 upon sine x, which is cosec x. Therefore, the given integral is equal to 1 upon square root of 2 integral cosec of 3 pi upon 4 plus x dx. And this is equal to 1 upon root 2 ln of modulus of tan of 3 pi upon 8 plus x upon 2 plus the constant of integration. And this is the required answer.